All right, I might have slightly fucked up quite badly last week, and I uh, accidentally recorded through my laptop's microphone rather than my USB microphone that I rode maybe a hundred miles to get round trip total, and that's pretty embarrassing. What? I I forgot to set it to record through the microphone, so it was recording through my laptop. Oh. That's that's embarrassing. Oh no. Oh no. But I've got it sorted out now, so it's fine. Yeah? Yeah. I had some stuff to do. Uh, buy some fucking bits for my piece of shit car. Uh, actually, before I buy any bits and waste money, I'll see what I got in the... what's new in the car lot. What are you doing? I'm going. Oh yeah, you're going to, to club. fucking you're going to programmers club. Cringe. And I'll show them my idea for a, uh, a game. The the Jew brainwashing game. Well, no, it's not the Jew brainwashing game. Oh. It's either you're working as a Jew. Yeah. In a world of Jews, or you're working as a Gentile going. In a world of Jews. In a world of Jews. And you're gonna make what about Oven Crush? Oven Crush. Yeah, the one no, where you have six that. million Jews and you have to gas them all in a certain oh, amount no. of years. I think that'd be two <laughs> on the nose. <laughs> Is that two on the nose? Yeah. Yeah. Masrax A, Abby T T, Eclipse A three. Alright, nothing I want. Let me just make some nice sounds for your microphone to pick up. Yeah, go ahead. You c it can't be any worse than the sounds that were coming through my fucking laptop microphone. There's no need for that. You don't need to. No do need that. for what? That you don't. You don't need to do that. There's no need. I don't know what you're talking about. That. Just. There's no need. You don't need to do that either. Oh, it fucking stinks of fucking various kinds of fruit now. Yeah? Yeah. Oh no. Whatever will you do. Smell the fruit. Fucking fruit. Hey yo. Going Friday. Huh? We're going Friday. Yeah, it? yeah. Where is that? Um, in one of the fucking Hellmore rooms. I can't remember which one. Yeah, I have no idea. We're going to fucking anime club, boys. <laughs> gang, gang. that's what you do at fucking university, you meet a bunch of black Dragon Ball watching autists and then you go to their fucking anime club. Up top. I ain't touching that. Okay, fine. What was I gonna? Oh, exhaust tips. Oh, the one that'll tell you where it is. Yeah. Could you imagine? Fucking programming club. I know for the, the anime one. I know what the. Oh, right, right. right. Well, we're in the fucking Discord. We don't need a bit of paper anymore. Hell 112. Hell 112? Do you have any idea what that is? You've been there? 
No, I haven't no. been anywhere in the main building. <laughs> Me neither. Well, I have. All my lectures are in the main building because it's right next to where we live. It makes yeah. it nice and easy for me. Mine are like half a mile down the road. We. <laughs> You're terror shy. <laughs> or something or other. Now it's just me. And the people on the other side of the door. Let's all be very quiet so that they don't hear me. Make some ASMR. Asthma. How long have I been recording for? Five minutes. Ten minutes left. And then I can finish recording for the rest of the day. You know, it was pretty bad when Jamie was in here. But now it's just me, it's even worse. You ever get that? I'm getting that right now. I'm getting that quite badly. I mean, jinkies. Speaking of jinkies, I watched an episode of uh, What's New Scooby Doo last night. Because. mainly because I remembered it existed. Oh! I went on Wikipedia, I checked up on Scooby-Doo, alright, you're gonna be impressed. No series of Scooby-Doo has had more than 52 episodes, which means that people only think Scooby-Doo went on forever because there's loads of different series, that, and most of the 70s ones are exactly the same. But because they were fucking repeated all the time, really makes you think. I'm pretty impressed with myself for doing all these drag races first try. I don't know where I learned how to do it, but it's all working out pretty well so far. Magazine cover to get on, I'll do that some other time. Right now, I just want to do an actual regular race. Where can I find one of those? Sprint races, are there any around where I am? No. Those are drag races, is there a circuit race around here? No. Street cross, there's one over there. And another drag race down there. Well, I'll finish up the Coal Harbour area. And then I'll look for actual races to do. So, drift. This shouldn't be too hard. Oh, a Lexus IS300. That reminds me, I bought a couple of uh, a couple more PS2 games uh, along with all the books. I told you last week about all the books I got because I'm trying to be become not retarded uh, to make my English uh, literature degree slightly easier. It, it helps. I mean, I've always been a, a strong reader, which is, you know, good. But, like, it, it would probably help you get an English degree if you actually read regularly, which is something that I haven't done since I was, as I said, 12. But along with all the books that I bought, I bought a couple of PS2 games, and one of them was Road Rage 3, which uh, was published by Atlas, which I recognise because they published Persona as well. Anyway, Road Rage 3 does not have nearly the polish that Persona has. But that's not the point. The point is that when I first played it, I thought it was a piece of shit game with uh, 
shitty physics and uh, the way the rivals don't scale to the car that you have that's pretty bad but once you pick an actually decent car and you figure out like how to drift properly because the game auto drifts for you so you have to control the car through the corners while it's drifting um, once you figure it out it's actually pretty good it's still slow it's a really slow game and uh, I don't know if it would help if I picked like a Nissan Skyline or something but I've been using the uh, an, an FB RX-7 just because it's a nice balance between low powered enough that the cars that the AI have well it's a mix between it's like a mid power car it's about 200 20, 230 horsepower, so it matches pretty right with the AI, except that I'm a much better driver than the AI are, so I win easily every time. When I first went on there I, I tried to use a, an S13, and that had nowhere near enough horsepower, so I gave up on that. It's just an initial D game, but all the tracks seem to be circuits so far. At least the ones that I've unlocked so far, they're all circuits. I don't know if there are going to be any point to points, but I hope there are. And that was bullshit. I don't know how the guy in the lead got so many points so quick. But it was bullshit that he did, so now I have to do it again. Anyway, the worst new Scooby-Doo episode I watched. Getting back on topic. Uh, it was a season 2 episode. It was the one about the house with the uh, AI in it that goes rogue. And uh, I watched it because I was going through the list of uh, what's new Scooby-Doo episodes because I wanted to find out who did the cover of Saber Dance that was in one of those episodes. Like the guitar one, which was I liked when I was a kid but never heard it outside of the episode. Uh, anyway, eventually I did find it. It's by um, some band. It's in my YouTube history, so I don't need to search for it anymore. Uh, the point is that I found... Well, I found out that What's New Scooby-Doo had a lot of actually interesting music in the chase scenes because their whole gimmick was that they had a different song. They had a chase scene every week and it had a different song in it. And... Uh, the music they picked for the chase scenes is actually pretty interesting. One of the episodes has a uh, Paul Van Dyke song, who you may know if you listen to classic trance, like I do. So I watched a whole episode of What's New Scooby Doo just for a three minute long clip of a Paul Van Dyke track that I'd heard a billion times. Scooby Doo, uh, fucking What's New Scooby Doo is not as well animated as I remember. I'll tell you that. Anyway, on that note, I'm going to finish recording. For now. I know that last week's episode I fucked up and I should probably do something to make up for that, but I can't be bothered. 
So now we're done. And uh, I'm going to get back into recording regularly if I can get over how embarrassing it is to talk to myself in a room on my own. Well, not. Well, the, the problem is that I'm not on my own. Uh. So I'll get back into recording Prize Sport Challenge 2 and uh, Ford Racing 2 and this and uh, and probably TT Superbikes. But we'll see.